Not many laps left to go. A white flag will be coming out any moment now to signify the beginning of the 19th lap, leaving them only one lap to go. And unless Howerton can put on a tremendous challenge in the last lap and a half, it looks like young Mark Barnett may go home the victor of the first race of the 1981 season. However, Howerton knows. Howerton knows he does not have much time. Howerton goes around the outside, and Howerton has taken over the lead with less than two laps to go. Coming for the white flag, Kent Howerton, the rhinestone cowboy on motorcycle number two, has passed his teammate Mark Barnett on bike number five that's been leading for so many laps. Kent Howerton, with less than a lap to go, has gotten by his teammate. Mike Bell still holding on to third place in a Yamaha. Several riders showing exhaustion now, pulling off the racetrack. Goat Breaker, the young lad on the Kawasaki for the first year, having a problem again going down, picking his bike up and entering back onto the racetrack. But this race now is in the hands of Kent Howerton on a Suzuki. The young Texan trying to get to the checkered flag before his teammate, the teammate who's been leading for so many laps, Mark Barnett. It's still Suzuki one and two, but there was a change in the lead. The lead was Barnett with Howerton second, but now it's Howerton trying to get down to that checkered flag. Howerton has very little distance to go. He has the checkered flag in sight. He's coming around some slower traffic. He has a left-hand turn to go. He's headed for the top of the hill, and he pulls it off. It's Howerton. It's followed very closely by Mark Barnett, his teammate. 